What up, YouTube people? This is the King Jose here, Jose, talking to you and reviewing and unboxing for you. All right, so here I got the Key Station Mini 32 right here, and I'm gonna do the unboxing for you. I made this review basically because I was looking on YouTube before I bought, actually bought this um, keyboard, and I couldn't find anybody actually setting up on a PC or a computer. Like all over seas, iPads and whatever, and I basically bought this because I wanted to use it um, for my laptop or for my desktop, and so I basically made this review and set up just for this. All right, let's open this thing up. Good looking keyboard we got here. This is got the keyboard and a Sibulus first CD. I guess this you could use it with the keyboard. And we got a USB standard plug in and play. Get the USB out. So no more USB. Alright, let's open this. It is pretty light, to tell you the truth. Um, this thing is meant for portable reasons. I'm using it because um, my desk is not that big and I would like to do music on it. The keys feel pretty good. Um, the size is not that much cramped up as I thought it would be. That's actually a good thing. Um, even though the black keys would feel a little bit weird, I don't know, gotta get used to it. I don't know. Um, right here, we have the volume. As you can see, this button is a Sust, Edit, Octata, and these are the modes that you can set different modes for. Alright, um, let me plug it in. Let's see. Turn this on. It is to the left, is where you plug in the USB. So we have it turned on. Doesn't need an extra power source. The USB is the power source. Alright, now I'm gonna go into my computer mode now. So All right, let's begin. begin. So Alright, so I have launched Pro Tools S E. So let's go right here and get the piano session. Choose piano. Yes, save. Okay, or exist. Hmm. Alright, so let's try to do that again. Choose. Yes, yes. Alright, so here we go. Let's get you guys over here. This is kind of a ghetto setup, but whatever works. Right. So here we are. Let's see. So here we are. These are the basic buttons. So these buttons, let's see what they do. So as you can see, automatically, Pro Tools detects. I didn't even have to set anything up. Or just keep this work. So 
so let's give it a quick review right here so as you can see I'm pressing it lightly and the sound is sounding lightly I press it hard you can hear it more so that is pretty well that they play that so as you press it harder it's louder obviously this is the volume for the keyboard alright now these buttons so these are the act and data if I press the plus symbol is raising the notes so that is because this is just a 32 keys this feature is for you like slide and keep on going with the notes when it's blinking that would mean that has reached the limit for going up and set it normal alright so let's create some beats with the drums hip hop and let's go to bass slap at the bass alright let's go to window media editor got it let's raise this up alright as you can see he already switched to drums. Alright, so here I'm not getting any sound. And why is that? Take you know. Because you gotta go up a level. No, down a level. So I'm getting more sound. So I'll press it again. I don't have sound here, but I have here. So here I have all the keys for this sample. Alright, so let's see. Alright, let's record that. So I'm just fooling around here. This I think this is a really nice easy setup and the way they've done this where you could just record and just on the way just get going. Alright, so just I'm just BSing there just to show you guys. Play, it's already recorded on. Alright, let's go back to piano. Let's go here. Try to take out a record. Alright, let's go back to piano. And just to show you guys. These buttons, I guess we'll tune it or something. Okay, sure. But I'm reading. Um, this button, sus button, S U S T, would be like the foot pedal for the piano, so it holds the note. Right, this buttons. I'm not quite sure what it does right now, but it's stopping from playing. So I don't know what it does right now. Alright, so basically that's it, guys. Um, I hope you enjoyed, uh, enjoyed this.
Alright, so that's it, guys. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. So, for next time, guys, see you later, and thanks for watching. Peace out.